Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing today? I am really good. I am back with a video for you today. You guys are seeing me with my hair all natural. I did not style it. It just is what it is. I've actually been trying to keep the heat off my hair and just let it repair itself. Do you believe I am going to go brunette for the fall and winter? So that may be coming soon for you. But I am back today with a little bit of a different Dollar Tree haul. It is all freezer foods. We had gone to the bigger Dollar Tree in Carlisle, which I can't really compare. I don't know how big the other one is. They have two in Carlisle. We just went to the one. I've never seen anything like it. They have deep freezers that you have to reach down into, tons of them, stocked to the top with freezer foods. So we bought a bunch of things here just to show you what is out there. No, we don't eat like this all the time because it's a lot of like quick microwave, little meals, snacks type things, but it's still nice to have them in the freezer. When the grandkids come around, they can just grab a quick snack and grab it and go. So I'm going to go ahead and get started here and I have my freezer bags. If you guys shop at Aldi's, get their freezer bags. They're massive and they're great. I have my freezer bags here to put this stuff right into so I can put it all back in the freezer. So I'm going to start over at this end of the desk. I picked up two boxes of these waffles. These are by the Creations brand. These are tried and true for us. We like them. The grandkids like them. They taste like the big name brand waffles. They are really good. So we picked up a box of the blueberry. It's 7.5 ounces and you get six waffles in here. And then we picked up the home style. So sometimes they want blueberry, sometimes they want home style. So we picked up a box of it as well. And it is 7.5 and you get six in here. And then I believe there is also a buttermilk flavor. And we've tried them all and they're all, they're amazing, they're great. So I'm gonna go ahead and shove this down here in the freezer bag. One of my top 10 items from the Dollar Tree is the TJ Farm Select, the pepper stir fry. And you get yellow onion, red, green, and yellow bell peppers. And this is a 12 ounce bag. I love these. I just, they come in handy for me. And I, I make a lot of things with peppers and onions. And for me, it's just convenience. Yes, I do buy fresh peppers, fresh onions, but quick, easy, and they're good. They're very fresh, nice big pieces. Almost every bag I have ever had, it's a beautiful mixture of all of them. I know one of you had commented and said that one of the bags you got had a lot more onions than peppers, but you know that's the risk you take, I guess, when, when you buy it, but I've never had a problem, and I love these. The taste is great, so I pick them up all the time. One of my top 10 items. Grab these for the grandkids. These are the Super Pretzel brand. These are the soft pretzel bites, and it's nine ounces in here. Nice size bag of these. We have not tried these yet, but we have tried this brand, the, the Super Pretzel. You know it's good. They're delicious. I love these type of pretzels. And they also had the Baker's Best, the full-size pretzels. And these are the baked soft pretzels. The salt packs are included, and it is 12.75 ounce nice big box. How many, did I say the ounces on this? Yes, nine ounces of these. And does it say how many pretzels you get in the big one, the full size? Let me see here. Servings per container are six. So you get six full size pretzels in here. And we love these. We love the soft pretzels. The kid loves them. Dip them in some cheese sauce or peanut butter. They're just, they're delicious. So if you guys have tried these, the little bites of, by the um, Super Pretzel Company, let me know what you think of them. But they have to be good. Go ahead and set this down here. This is something I'm not quite sure we have ever tried before, but it's by the Snaps brand. And these are mac and cheese bites. It says, great taste, great price. It's five ounces in here. Breaded and fried macaroni and cheese. Have you guys tried these? If you have, please let me know how they are. It was different. We never, I don't think we've ever seen them before. Five ounces, 
and is it just one serving? The whole package is the serving size. So we're gonna, next time the grandkids are around, we're gonna go ahead and try these and see what, what they think. They all love mac and cheese. Well, Harper, she can take it or leave it, but the rest of the grandkids love it. Interesting. It would probably be good in an air fryer. So just pick that up because it was different. They had all of these Celeste pizzas. These are nice. I, I like these myself. I actually do it in the toaster oven and not the microwave because it seems like the microwave makes the crust kind of rubbery. You, do, you know what I mean. So I do it in the toaster oven. And these are very, very good. Nice little single size pizza. And they did have other flavors, but I picked up the pepperoni. And it says microwave in minutes by the Celeste brand. Pizza for one. They're good. And I believe you can get these in Walmart in the grocery store. Any of these brand names. You know, and some of this stuff, they may be a few cents cheaper at Walmart. Some are cheaper at Dollar Tree. So, you know, it is what it is when it comes to that. But we were at Dollar Tree. One of the things the grandkids really love are these Bosco sticks. We have picked these up in the past, and these are good. And if you don't know what a Bosco stick is, it's almost like a bread stick, but there's cheese on the inside. And I believe it's mozzarella. Yes, it's mozzarella cheese on the inside. And it says bread stick stuffed with mozzarella cheese. And I haven't been telling you guys the Best Buy date. I'm sorry about that, but this is five of 23. These are so good. Just delicious. Great to have with an Italian meal. If you make lasagna or spaghetti, throw a couple of these in your little toaster oven or air fryer. They are so good. And these are a nice size stick. I can't eat a whole one of these. I have to cut it in half. They're just delicious. And it is by the Bosco brand. Why am I thinking this is there's another name attached to this. Who is it? No, I guess not. Oh, Tyson Foods. They are made by Tyson Foods. I knew there was another company name attached to that. But these are very good. If you can see it there, they're delicious. And they also had all kind of Hot Pockets, every flavor you could imagine. But Hubby won't eat these, and I will. So <laughs> I picked up I actually picked up two and ate one already. But these are the Hot Pockets brand, and this is the pepperoni pizza flavor. <clears throat> and how many ounces is this? Let me see here quickly. Four ounces, nice size, regular size Hot Pocket. And I believe these only come in a two pack at Walmart, and they are cheaper at Dollar Tree by a few cents. So yeah, Hot Pocket, delicious. And they did have other flavors as well, but I stuck with the pepperoni pizza. These, I see so many people raving about these, and they fly off the shelves because they are that good. They're the Spring Rolls by Jennifer's Garden, and it says Traditional Vegetable Spring Rolls. And you get eight in here, and it is a 7.05 ounce, and these are very, very good. People microwave them, of course, but they're good in the air fryer. They're good in the toaster oven. I use my little toaster oven a lot for this type of thing instead of heating up the oven. And I would rather have things cooked in either the oven or toaster oven than the microwave. So these are delicious. If you haven't tried these and you like this type of thing, give them a try. They are very, very good. And almost everybody that I have seen haul those and then try them have liked them. And then, guys, they had all of the Michelina brand. This is also a big name brand. They had so many to choose from. This is, Hubby picked this out. This is the beef and peppers. You know, nice size serving in here. This would be great for a quick little supper or lunch. And the serving size is one packet, or the whole package. I'm going to see if I can find a Best Buy date quickly on this, and I cannot. So, but I'm sure it'll be fine, you know, in the freezer for a very long time. But they had the beef and peppers. Is there rice in there as well? Bell pepper sauce with rice, seasoned beef patty crumbles. 
And I thought the kids might like these or the youngest little grand lady, you know, now that she's eating more, you know, every solid food. This is the pop and chicken. It says white chicken nugget patty fritters and fun formed mashed potatoes. And they're like the little mashed potato fries with the little chicken nuggets. It is a 4.5 ounce package. Then they had just the macaroni and cheese, an eight ounce pack of mac and cheese. And these are all the Michelina, Michelina's brand, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. And they also had the chicken fried rice. So I thought I would try this one when hubby tries the beef and peppers. This just sounded a lot more like something I would enjoy. It is also an eight ounce package, 11 grams of protein, and it says white chicken with rice. So I think that looked really, or I thought that looked really good. So those were the four of this brand that we picked up. Chicken fried rice, mac and cheese, pop and chicken, and beef and peppers. And there could have been more that we didn't get because there was so much of this stuff, guys. And then they had so many banquet products. And I'm sure these are probably a few cents cheaper at Walmart, but that's okay because we were at Dollar Tree and we weren't going to be running to Walmart. They had the beef pot pie, and it says flaky crust made from scratch, and it's a seven ounce pot pie. Harper really likes chicken pot pies. And they had the chicken and broccoli pot pie, also seven ounce. I don't think I've ever tried the chicken with broccoli. And they had just the regular chicken pot pie, and that's Harper's favorite. And it is also a seven ounce. And I believe that there were more flavors of the pot pies, but we grabbed these three because they were the ones that I knew that we personally would eat. And then they had all of these different banquet little quick meals. They have the, <clears throat> excuse me guys, they had the chicken fingers with mac and cheese and it says breaded white meat chicken patties and macaroni and cheese sauce made with 100% natural chicken breast, 6.5 ounce. They have the chicken nuggets and fries. So this one had mac and cheese, this one has fries. And these are more like fingers, like chicken fingers, and these are the little round nuggets. But it says breaded white meat chicken nugget patties with french fries, 100% natural chicken breast, 4.85 ounce. They also, hubby got this to try, it is the backyard barbecue meal. It says macaroni and cheese sauce with barbecue sauce and rib shaped patty. And it, the rib shaped patty is made with pork and chicken. It says made with real cheese and it's an eight ounce. He wanted to give that a try. This I've just, mm mm, no. And then they had the Salisbury steak meal. And we actually buy Banquet the big packs of Salisbury steak from Walmart. And it has Salisbury steak patties made with chicken, beef, pork, and beef, and gravy with macaroni and cheese sauce. And it says mac and cheese made with real cheese, eight ounces. So we picked up, picked up one of these to try. And like I said, some of these I'm sure are a few cents cheaper at Walmart. Some are a few cents cheaper at Dollar Tree. But why not, you know, stock up on that kind of stuff? Quick, easy meals. No, guys, don't come after me. We do not eat like this all the time. We just don't. A lot of these things I pick up to show you, but then we do go ahead and try so I can give reviews in my, my um, finds and fails video. But I think it's great, and I have never seen a freezer section like that big store in Carlisle. It, it was incredible. It was like the whole way down the store, and then there was like upright freezers and refrigerator section the whole way along the outside. It was amazing. So if I ever get back there, maybe I'll be able to get some video for you guys, but we'll see. It's a little trek from us to get there, but it was nice going and checking it out. So yeah, guys, please don't mind me. I look, I look a mess today, but just didn't feel like doing my hair. So anyway, I am going to get off of here and get all this stuff put back in the freezer, and I may jump into another video for you. I have so many videos to catch up on, guys. 
having the grand ladies here for a week and then my daughter and son-in-law came for the weekend and it just kind of things just kind of piled up and I loved every minute of it we had such a great time having the grandkids here we had all of the grandkids here for a little pool party cousin get together and they just love being together and that's so nice and so it was kind of a busy week with them here but we had so much fun we went on a ghost tour in Gettysburg and that was great it was just a, a riot it was the kids love that kind of stuff and they enjoyed themselves so much it was just fun to do it something different something we've never done before lived in this area me for over 18 years hubby for who knows how long over 20 something and it never took a ghost tour in Gettysburg if you ever make it to Gettysburg go do it it's just fun and it really didn't cost that much either the one that we went on I think it was $14 per person and it was a great time so glad we did it I'm glad the kids were here that's probably their last trip for a long visit now with school starting and they'll get busy with all of that so I'm just gonna get back into my routine routine and start pumping out more videos for you guys anyway I've chatted enough I hope you all are doing well if you like this type of thing please subscribe I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family if you haven't checked out my daughter's channel the holistic homesteader I'll link her in the description box below go check her out I'm sure she'd love to have you as part of her YouTube family as well you guys are the best have a great day everybody and I'll talk to you again here really soon peace